Cosmos Chem C3000 kit. There are lots of pieces in it, and today we will be assembling the alcohol burner. To do so, we will be using the burner piece right here, um, the cap, and then these pieces right here. And of course, the most important piece of the kit is safety goggles or safety glasses with side pieces. To assemble the alcohol burner, you start by taking this aluminum disc and the wick holder. You, to put them together, you look at your aluminum disc. You slide this onto here, like so. You make sure to have the dome side facing up. So if you look at it, it will look like this. And if you were to put a drop of water in there, it would not flow out because it's curved down like a bowl. Next, you place the insulating piece on the outside of this. Get first. And, and now, you simply take the wick and insert it. You do so by putting one edge in and then pinching it so it goes in. And then you continue by pinching it and turning. This is not a super fast process. So be sure you take your time and do it carefully. Then you'll see it start popping through the end. And you want to push it all the way through so it just is at the very top. Now you can pull it from the other end. Next, you take your burner base and you test this and put it in. And it should fit nicely like this. Perfect. For the next step, you will need your burner base and a funnel. I to allow air. You will put the funnel in like this. For the next part, you may need an adult assistant. You need to pour some denatured alcohol into the bottle. You need to be sure to observe the maximum fill line so you do not fill too full. Turn the bottle around for... Uh, is it right there? Yes. Is it that line? As you can see, this is the max fill line. On this burner base, it says max fill line. So it's very simple. To remove the funnel, you will want a paper towel, and you will want to remove it very carefully to be sure there are no drips. And just like that. And then you will need to wipe the sides of the burner base to make sure that there's no extra alcohol on it. Next, you can insert the wick by just placing it in. And then, you can place on the burner cap, which is a metal cap. And now you are ready for experiment number one.